sex linked genes they are also called as sex linked traits a gene which is located on either of the sex chromosome is called as sex linked gene while on the other hand all those traits whose genes are present on either of the sex chromosome they are called as sex linked traits if we take the examples of sex linked traits and how they inherit from the father and mother into the children if we take here the example that a father with a disorder transmit the mutant allele to all the daughters this is the father that have disease father will transmit this allele to all the daughters while he will not transfer the disease to any of the son because in case of son from the father sperm uh, that consist of y chromosome will be transferred to the son as there is a y chromosome and from the mother there is x chromosome and x chromosome is here normal so all the son which will be produced to this couple they will be normal because the daughter they have x chromosome from the father and x chromosome from the mother so the daughter they will be the carriers of the disease take an other example of the sex linked genes in this case the carrier female this is the carrier female mates with the normal male male is normal as a result of this cross there will be 50% chance that each daughter will be a carrier here is the two daughters that will be produced daughter 1 and daughter 2 and there will be 50% chance that the daughter will be produced as the carrier of that disease while there will be 50% chance that each son will carry the disease if we take here there are two sons this son is normal while this son is affected so in such a cross where female is carrier and the male is normal there will be 50% chance that the daughters they will be the carrier of that disease while the son they will be affected the third example of sex linked gene is in case of if the female is carrier if a carrier female mates with the male that is with the disorder male is diseased he has the disease if there is a cross between these two types carrier female and the affected male that each child born to this couple there will be a regardless of the sex either the daughter will be affected with the disease or the male will be affected with the disease there are many diseases in the humans which are called as sex linked disorders the most common examples of those diseases that is the color blindness duchenne muscular dystrophy and hemophilia are the examples in the human the genes of these disorders of the these traits are related to the uh, x chromosomes or the sex chromosomes in case of humans color blindness is a disease which is related with the x chromosome if we take here the example of color blindness these are those individuals which cannot distinguish between the green color and the red color if we show them these figures they cannot identify that there is written 5 on this diagram and they cannot identify that there is written 29 on this diagram so color blindness is a disease in those individuals and those individuals cannot identify or distinguish between the green color and the red color if we see that how color blindness inherits in the individuals normal female is xx and the normal male is xy while in case of color blindness a female will have a disease f if she has both the affected alleles while in case of carrier 
if she has one normal copy this is the normal copy of x chromosome and this is the affected allele if she has one normal copy and one affected copy then she will be the carrier of the color blindness while in case of color blind male there will have a affected copy of x chromosome the allele which is present on the x chromosome that will be the affected one if we perform the crosses between a normal father and a color blind mother how the disease will inherit in case of normal father and in case of color blind mother all the daughters they will be the carriers this is the daughter she will be carrier daughter she will be carrier daughter she will be the carrier while the sons they will be color blind because the, there is no alternative x chromosome in case of male there is a y chromosome and there is only one allele due to one affected allele the sons they will be the color blind while in case of three daughters they will be the carrier because they have a normal allele on the other x chromosomes this chromosome contains normal allele same is here this also contains normal allele this also contains normal allele so the daughters they will be the carrier they will not express the disease while the sons they will be color blind while in case of if the mother is normal and the father is color blind in such a case all the daughters uh, will be carrier and son they will be the normal like here if we will see here is the daughter xx and this is the daughter also xx both have one normal allele and one affected allele this is the normal allele on chromosome x and this is affected allele while in case of uh, males or in case of sons they have one x chromosome and one y chromosome and there is no affected allele in case of sons so the sons they will be the normal so we can conclude that any gene which is present on either of the sex chromosome is called as sex linked gene and all those traits phenotypes which are are due to those genes which are present on sex chromosome that can be on the x chromosome that can be on the y chromosome are called as sex linked traits